This is your Gospel History Moment, spotlighting contemporary, traditional, and quartet artists who have impacted the music world. This week is the Blind Boys of Alabama. The Blind Boys of Alabama first sing together in the school chorus in 1939 at the Alabama Institute for the Negro Blind in Talladega, Alabama. All around nine years old at the time, the founding members were Clarence Fountain, George Scott, Velma Boysman Trailer, Johnny Fields, Olus Thomas, and the only sighted member, J.T. Hutton. The earliest version of the group was known as the Happy Land Jubilee Singers and originally performed for World War II era soldiers at training camps in the South. The group's first professional performance was on June 10, 1944. In 1945, the members dropped out of school and began touring the gospel circuit. The group has won a long list of awards, sang for presidents, and was inducted into the Gospel Music Hall of Fame. The group's founding member, Clarence Fountain, born on November 28, 1929 in Tyler, Alabama, died on June 3, 2018 at the age of 88 from diabetes. Fountain had ceased performing on stage in 2007, but continued to record with the group in studio sessions. This has been your Gospel History Moment. To get your artist or group spotlighted, call 845-693-2484 and be sure to tune in next week for the Gospel History Moment. When we first were we 